Hello everyone, it's me A summary welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you the outdoor portrait which is uh, the main image was like that and after adding my preset and uh, the here is a cross processing the color effects pro I just got this result by using my theories I'll show you step by step how to apply my preset and how to add the other tone in this photo and let's start the tutorial if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications i'm just deleting all the stuffs uh, except the main image press ctrl or command j this is the shortcut to make another layer of the image so here uh, the low types things that means the low lights and other stuffs so after that going to the filter from here and camera filter by the way i'm using photoshop 2022 and the camera 14.1 so from here here is the three dots that is the settings menu and load settings options i made a preset outdoor girls and I apply this one into this photo so let's see the before one was like then and after one uh, so in a before uh, the natural types things uh, now which is uh, traditional and advanced things i used over here so how i made this one let's see the settings before that if you're new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications here the calibration uh, and let's start from the basic from here now uh, the temperature that is plus 8 tint 0 that is the exposure 0 0.41 and the contrast plus 6 highlights minus 15 and the shadow plus 39 if you make the shadow down it will be like this but i don't want to just because of in a sunny day you are getting the too much shadow in the in other uh, sides of the photos that means um, uh, the uh, beach sides over here and the whites plus 8 and the uh, blacks that is minus 12 here the texture 0 and the clarity minus 10 if you make the clarity up uh, it would be like that uh, if you want you can keep the clarity like this so here the dehaze like that if you make the dehaze up and down let's see what is happening so dehaze if i make this one down uh, actually plus value uh, it will be more um, like uh, uh, crispy or um, like uh, the foggy things just gone here the vibrance plus 32 and the saturation minus 22 uh, that is the technique uh, if i make this one like that it would be the more uh, like uh, uh, color um, colorize uh, which is not cool and the curves from the tone curve i used only the rgb tone curve from here input value 1 output value 3 input value 19 output value 22 input value 54 output value 55 and here input value 107 output value 104 input value 164 output value 149 and in this portion input value 255 and output value 253 that's fine from here the detailing option sharpening 33 and the radius 0.5 and the detail plus 35 that's good the color mixture from here you are getting the three important things which is the hue saturation luminance hue is a color which color will be defined with the hue and the saturation uh, the percentage of the color and the luminance the intensity of the color let's see hue i used here the red hue that is 10 and the orange yeah, that is 4 yellow 9 green plus 60 and the aqua minus 29 if you make this one in a minus value you are getting the different color in a plus value you are getting also different colors so in a aqua portion if you go the left side you are getting the green and if you go to the right side you are getting the pure blue in the blue portion you are getting the minus 34 value that is a little bit the uh, blue that is the aqua tone if you go to the uh, left side it will gi give you the aqua color and the purple options uh, that is uh, in a left side you are getting blue and the right side you are getting magenta i just me given here minus 19 and the magenta minus 22 saturation percentage of the color I made the red only up all the stuffs are down suppose here the orange minus 15 the yellow minus 20 uh, the minus 37 for the green aqua minus 26 30 uh, for the blue and the 36 for the purples and the 40 minus 44 for the magenta luminance the intensity of the color uh, red orange and yellow these three colors are down that means the minus value uh, if you make the intensity that means the luminance down it will be dim type uh, and the intensity up it will be like a light type the green minus 9 aqua plus 6 blue plus 10 purples 14 and the magenta plus 11 the color getting options 
three things defined with the color grading the shadow mid tone and highlight and which color will be in a shadow which color will be in a mid tone and the highlight it defines the color grading this is the main technique and the basic of the color grading so in the hue portion you are getting to 210 which is the shadow um, for the shadow color actually uh, here the hue always remember that the hue is that things the color that means 210 that is the color point of the hue and the percentage of the color that means the saturation 40 and the luminance minus 16 from here the mid tone 38 and the minus uh, plus 7 for the saturation and the luminance 12 and here the highlight that is uh, i didn't use any color in a highlight actually so from here uh, you are getting the, the optics geometry and the effects and the gray, uh, calibration from the effects um, you can add the wind uh, vignetting uh, which is really good you can get the uh, dark color in the, in the uh, all sides and uh, over here and the calibration portion you are getting the three primary color red primary green primary and blue primary red primary you are getting the 14 blue primary you are getting the 7 and the uh, uh, green primary plus 7 and the blue primary minus 11 uh, here always uh, getting the hue and the uh, saturation hue minus 11 and uh, the green primary plus 7 all that stuff and hit the ok button I'll provide you the preset in my video description please check it out and after that going to the filter again and going to the Nick collection and color fix pro 4 color fix pro 4 is another plugins for the photoshop and it is really good to add any kind of um, filters in your um, photography here the cross processing from here uh, lots of method over here and here l02 and hit the ok button it will take time to load and providing you the final output which i use in the earlier images so it's taking time to load it up almost done yeah let's see the before one and after one here is uh, another option which is the levels options you can adjust the levels of your photography and let's see the before and after hues change the modern modern tone for the outdoor photography you know, like the beach side and other stuff so hope that you'll be benefited hope that you like this video and uh, any kind of like uh, comments or query please do comment in my video comment section until the next video i'm asmr if signing out stay safe stay at home keep me in your prayers bye bye